Soil is a very complex material and one of the big challenges facing a geotechnical engineer is how do you predict its behaviour when you're designing a tunnel, a foundation for a skyscraper, a deep excavation, a dam. What I want to show you in this brief video is that soil is made up of individual particles. This single fact is absolutely crucial to understanding its behaviour. Now I've got some examples of different types of soil here. Gravel, obviously made up of particles. Sand, obviously made of particles too. Silt, which you find at the bottom of lakes, is made of particles, but you need a magnifying glass to see them. And clay. Now this is stiff, but if you dry it out, it looks like this. And if you look at the dried out clay under an electron microscope, you will see that it is also made of particles. The first thing we need to consider is how a material made up of individual particles can resist load. Now here we have a model soil made up of circular disks to represent the particles. Now if I push on one side of this stack of particles, we see that they slide past one another. So to conclude, in this video we have learned that soil is made up of particles and that a soil's ability to resist loads is generated by shearing resistance at the particle contacts.